Hey, this is episode one of the Lao Wai Chef, and today we're going to make some fantastic pork burgers using a few of these ingredients. We have got some <coughs> lean ground pork, uh, which is very abundant in China. We don't do ground beef here very often, and we got our sesame seed buns, we've got some cheddar cheese, we've got a white onion, we've got three red chili peppers, some mustard, salt, pepper, a little bit of olive oil, and some lettuce and garlic, and one egg. And that is what we're going to use to make the best spicy pork burgers you've ever tasted. Now we're going to go ahead and get these all cut up. You're going to want to cut up your onions and your tomatoes and uh, you're going to want to dice up your red chilies and your garlic. I'm going to get a little closer in here. Okay, so we have everything here. So we're going to go ahead and cut this up and I'll cut right back to you. Pause it. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. All right, all right. Are, are we still filming? Are we still filming? All right, let's go. Okay, so we've got our onions, our lettuce, and our tomatoes sliced here. I'm using romaine lettuce with the stalks included. I prefer iceberg, but this is all I had at the store. If you want to get in a little close there, this is how I, I slice my onions, rounded, the tomatoes rounded, the lettuce parted out. And then I've got some diced up red chili peppers here. This is going to add spice to our burgers. And I've got uh, four pieces of diced garlic chopped very fine here. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and add our garlic, our red chili peppers chopped. This is three peppers. I'm going to add that all in there. We're going to take our egg right here. We've got an egg and an egg. Okay, let's throw that away. We're going to take a little bit of mustard. We're going to take about one teaspoon of mustard. This is deli mustard. It gives a good spice. Just a couple little squirts of that in there. We're going to take a little bit of, a little bit of salt. bit of black pepper and we're going to stir that up. This is what we're going to use to make our patty base. Cut. Go. Okay, so now we have mixed up our ground beef, our uh, salt, our pepper, our garlic, and our red chilies, and our mustard, and our egg all together. The egg acts as a binder for that uh, for that patty. Now we're just going to add the rest of it to this patty here. Okay, and now we're just going to turn these into patties. We're going to smooth it out. We're going to turn it into a round shape. So you can shape it with your spoon. Nice. Okay, so we've got our patties laid out here. What I did was I spooned out that from the bowl and I made them into nice circular patties right here. I've got olive oil heating up right here and I've got my buns laid out right on over here. I've got the buns, sesame seed buns, with both with mayonnaise. My girlfriend Maggie, the beautiful Maggie who is filming, say hi Maggie. Hi. And she wants ketchup only, she doesn't like mustard, so, and I've got ketchup and mustard right here. So let's get on over here, we're going to, this pan's getting a little hot here, nice and ready to go here. So we are going to take uh, these patties right here and we're going to use, let's take this big knife over here to get the whole patty. We're going to go like this. Why don't you come on over here? I'm going to lay out that patty right there, there we go. And we're going to get our other one here. Now I realize these patties are a little big. You could easily do two burgers with the size of these patties, but we're just going to do one each. Ooh, a little up there. Now, you want to get in close on there, baby. We've got two patties cooking right there. We're going to give these four minutes on each side. Four minutes now. You want to make sure they're cooked throughout. So let's check in four minutes on each side and I will get back to you. Okay, go ahead and cut it, babe. Cooking our burgers for about 10 minutes. I, I cook these burgers five, uh, three to five minutes longer than normal because these are very thick burgers. The thinner your burger, you get about half the time. So a burger like this thin, 
three to four minutes, something like this thin, you're going to want to give it about 10 minutes. So if you take a look here, we've got some big burgers here. And they are fully cooked on both sides, flipped over two times each. So we can take our heat off now. And now what we're going to do, we're going to clear a space on the cutting board here. Actually, we're going to use a different cutting board because this one is dirty. Use a clean cutting board here. We're going to take our patties out. Nice and lean, not greasy. Well done. Not perfectly circular, but you know, no one's grading us. That's okay. And we're going to let these patties cool down for about 5 to 10 minutes because if you put them on <laughs> if you put them on the bun right away, it's too hot. It's just going to sog right through the bread. Your bread's going to get soggy. So you want to let these cool down for 5 to 10 minutes. 10 minutes at least is optimal, honestly. And then you're just going to layer up your burger. So the next time I see you, these burgers will be complete and ready to eat. Cut. Okay, so our patties have been cooling for about 5 to 10 minutes now. We're about ready to assemble our burgers. Come on over here. So we got everything together here. Our buns are all spread out. Let's do it. So here we go. Don't worry, my hands are clean. I'm going to go like this. Put both our patties here on the mayonnaise side. And we're going to add our vegetables now. Tomatoes first. Lettuce. And then our onions. And then I like pickles quite a bit, so I'm going to do a couple pickles as well. Maggie's not a fan of pickles, so I'll leave her be with that. <clears throat> Let's combine them together. Here we go. And that is our finished product, ladies and gentlemen. Go ahead and take a look there, sweetie. You see that in the light there? That is our pork. Delicious pork spicy burger. I'll take the... I'll take a bite right now. Here, let's go ahead and take a bite. Oh yeah. That is the good stuff, folks. Let's take a look in here. Nice and well cooked there. That is a delicious burger. Because if you really want to know how I am, I'll tell you. Well, actually, Ross, there's some advice I need. About what? A subject to which you'll find both first. Six.